Hey everyone, uh, all right, so a few questions that have come in that they have been very consistent, um, especially since we've been locked down, and the questions have been, um, what is my training routine while we're on lockdown? What body parts am I training? How many times a week, etc.? The other one is, can I please film my workouts uh, for motivation, to show you guys for motivation? and inspiration and the other one is uh that i've been getting quite frequently is is what is my weight uh you never ask a man what his weight is uh <laughs> my we'll start backwards um my weight is 281 pounds i'm feeling good um trying to keep my diet on point uh lean and mean i'm feeling good my cardio is great i feel strong uh very fortunate you know look i i i, I don't take any of this shit for granted that i've been the lucky son of a bitch for years to have my own personal gym. Um, so I made sure and I promised myself that when we did get put on lockdown and when the lockdown went to effect that I was gonna train my ass off harder than uh, you know I've ever trained before and try to raise the own, my own personal bar in terms of intensity. Uh, so I get in here and I'm working hard. You know, out of this, whenever it gets lifted, I have to go back to work. Uh, I have to finish shooting a movie called Red Notice. And then, of course, there is um, the big DC Universe movie called Black Adam that I've been training for for months and months and months. So um, it's always easier to stay in shape than to get in shape. And uh, so 281 pounds, I'm feeling good. Uh, the diet has been on point and strict, um, with the exception of the massive cheat meals and the tequila cheat meals that, <laughs> that I have seemingly every night with the tequila. Um, Will I shoot my workouts for you guys? You know, I, I am, I'm admittedly sensitive about filming my workouts. Uh, a lot of you guys have been asking for weeks now uh, to show my workouts, and I'm not going to do it. I, um, you know, look, I'm, I'm sensitive in the fact that there are millions and millions and millions of you around the world who don't have the opportunity to get to your gym to work out because you know we all who love working out, working out and training. Uh, and physical fitness is our anchor. And when you don't have your anchor, uh, you know, that's when, you know, the, the mental stress and the anxiety kicks in. You gotta do all you possibly can to be, um, to try and find, you know, that anchor again. So anyway, bottom line is I'm sensitive. It would make me feel like an asshole if I was like, hey guys, look at the amazing workouts I'm getting here. Look at this gym, phenomenal. How's your workouts coming along? I'm not gonna do it. I'll let other celebrities do that shit. That's just not my style. But you know, when the um, when the ban is lifted and gyms start opening up around the world, as they are, I think you know, this week and next week, um, then I will start showing my workouts. And but look, you know, the bottom line is I cannot wait for all of you around the world to get back in the gym and find your anchor and get back in and tap into your mana because you know those workouts that you guys are going to have when you finally get back in the gym you're going to be beast they're going to be dominating workouts they're going to be epic workouts and i want that for all of you guys so until then i'm not showing my workouts just know that you can live vicariously through my training and i i have enough rage <laughs> that i have to work out anyway so just know that i am working out extremely hard um, okay, so my workout, what is it? Uh, my weekly workout now is Mondays, I do, I'll stretch, I'll do my abs, and I will train chest, and then I'll do cardio. And then afterwards I'll stretch again, and on Mondays I'll also train my calves. Uh, don't neglect your calves, boys. You never want chicken legs, you don't want that. <laughs> um, so I train my calves probably two, three times a week. Uh, on Tuesday is a big day as well, big body part, it's back, I'll train back, um, I'll stretch, I will uh, train my abs, I train abs every day, um, abs, upper abs, lower abs, my obliques, I also work on my core every day, uh, so I'll, I'll stretch, I'll do my abs, then I'll train back, and then I'll do cardio, uh, Wednesday, oh and then uh, on Tuesday, Tuesdays and Wednesdays, I like to train my neck. So I train neck um, again two to three times a week, just like I do my calves. And um, even though a lot of you guys aren't into actually training neck, it's a good thing to kind of stretch your neck out. It's always really important uh, because all your muscles go up into your neck. So, um, plus I wrestled and played football for years, so I've always had to have a strong neck. 
Uh, and on Wednesday, Wednesday, I'll do shoulders and I'll do uh, abs again. And I will do cardio after I train my shoulders. I like to concentrate, uh, I train my rear delts first. I pre-exhaust my rear delts uh, first and then I'll start to go around and start training my shoulders and I'll end my shoulder routine doing a uh, compound movement of some sort of presses. Uh, on Thursday, I'll train arms um, and uh, the thunder cookies, as we call them, or as I call them uh, when I'm drunk. <laughs> I'll train my arms and I'll probably train calves again on Thursday and, uh, and then I'll do cardio. On Friday, at the end of the week, is when I ramp back up the intensity. That's when I train two major body parts in one day. I'll train chest and back. It's a big day, it's an intense day. And then uh, I'll do my cardio again. And then on Saturday, Saturday to end the week, is the biggest workout of the week. I train legs and um, it is it requires the greatest amount of energy output. Um, and it is a beast of a workout, but it's a great way to end the week. I will not do cardio after I train legs because I'm so exhausted. And I will stretch though. I'll probably throw in my calves again on leg day. And then on Sunday, usually what I like to do, uh, if I have a full schedule, I'm actually working um, in my other job. Uh, I won't train, but since I'm not, I usually get my ass in here and start doing some sort of training or stretching or meditating or maybe a little cardio, maybe some abs, just something. Uh, and then I start the week right back up uh, all over again. So thank you guys for the questions. I really appreciate it. Thank you for keeping this Q&A going. It's some of the best parts of my day that we could stay engaged, stay connected uh, with all you guys around the world. And, you know, I don't know what you guys are going through around the world, but I do know that we are all, regardless of uh, what color our skin is, where we're from, what our occupation is, uh, what our religion is, it doesn't matter. Um, I don't know what you guys are going through, but I do know that we are all experiencing this thing together. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's the uh, same game, different levels, same hell, different devils, but we are gonna get through this thing, and we are gonna be better for it, more informed, smarter, and I believe we're gonna be more aware, and I be also believe we're gonna be more compassionate and more empathetic. Um, but that's for other answers down the road. Uh, thank you guys for the questions. I appreciate it. Most importantly, stay healthy, stay safe, and um, try and stay positive. I know it ain't easy, but we gotta try and stay positive. We'll talk soon. Thanks.